Welcome to Remember the Great Sports. As a lifelong sports fan, I have always enjoyed creating all-time great teams. Growing up in the 80s and 90s, before the internet, I was the typical kid who would play video games, collect sports cards, and try to read as much as I could about athletes and major sports. Without any doubt, my favorite sport is baseball. It is not that I don't like the other major sports, but perhaps it was the fact that baseball seemed like it was more popular than its counterparts during that era. This was probably because baseball was the only major sports team in my area during my youth. I used to create my own fantasy teams and notebooks and such, and it really was fun to me doing the research reading about the legends of baseball while I was compiling those lists. As a fan, I decided to start a channel dedicated to the legends of the game. I decided to actually put the effort and thought into creating these teams, to be realistic and not have, say, an outfield of the Yankees with DiMaggio, Mantle, and Ruth. With that being said, the criteria for the teams I came up with are Number 1. To start, I am only going to do the 9 positions and 1 bench position player, in the event of a DH would be needed. I will omit the DH from the batting order to use the non-DH rules, only because I like to think of this as a uh, type of uh, old school baseball team. In the event a DH would be needed, obviously you could adjust your lineup to fit the needs for that. Number two, the player must have actually played the position. Every position on the field must be played by the player. This means that Joe DiMaggio can't be a left fielder on a Yankees great team because he only played 67 games in his entire 13-year career in left field. This would mean someone like DiMaggio wouldn't make the team with Mickey Mantle ahead of him unless he was the guy on the bench. Number three, all players chosen are from 1999 and previous. To make it different than other lists, I decided to base the teams from 1999 and down. I recognize the facts that greats such as Derek Jeter, A-Rod, Mike Trout, and others are some of the greatest the game has ever seen, but I wanted to create these teams to remember some of the greats who have been forgotten. In the future, I will perhaps approach doing a comprehensive team from any year, but for now I want to base it on the nostalgia of me being the 10-year-old dreaming of those forgotten legends. Number four, one manager will be selected. To be further unique, I am going to add the greatest managers for each team as well. This also would be from prior to 1999 as the previous stated criteria. Number five, a player can appear on multiple teams only if they play at minimum of five years on their team. So listing a person, say like Ricky Henderson as the Mets' greatest left fielder, doesn't qualify, being he only spent two years there, and he spent the bulk of his career in other places. And finally, the selection is based on the stats a player accumulated while on the team. So a journeyman like Henderson would probably only be considered on an A's all-time team and not the other eight teams he suited up for during his career. In short, this is all for fun. I came up with this criteria only because this is pretty much the same method I used since I was a 10 year old. The purpose of these teams is to have fun. I don't consider myself an expert and I just want to capture some of the greatest players who have been perhaps forgotten and give my respect to those who played in the era so long ago. I hope this inspires others to maybe create their own videos with their all-time teams. So let's sit back and enjoy.